Yes, and welcome back to Train Simulator 2018 as I try to go from becoming a complete noob to someone who can actually maybe drive a train, but I don't know. We'll just see how we go. So far, so good. You remember from last episode, uh, we did uh, primary controls for diesel, DMU, electric, and steam. So we're going to continue into the secondary controls for all four of those particular engines. Remember, guys. I'm going to say it now, just smash that like button right now. Why don't you do it? It saves you having to do it later on, and I know you want to do it. So if you do enjoy these videos, smash the like button. But also, if you're a bit of an expert, let me know if I'm doing anything wrong. I mean, obviously, during these tutorials, it's probably pretty straightforward. But as we get out there and try to drive one ourselves, I really look forward to all your comments. So let me know uh, what you think. Anyway, secondary controls. Let's get into the diesel. Let's start this scenario. I'll catch you there. And they are throwing some rain at us, everybody. Here we are, back in our first train that I've completely forgotten the name of. The SD70 Mac, there we go. I knew it was something like that. All right, now we know, oh, look at this. In this lesson, we'll learn about additional controls that engineers frequently use. The camera will change each time. Okay, we know that, complete. Okay, okay, we know that. Oh, look at that rain. Fat raindrops. When it's dark outside, it can be hard to see the track. Really? Activate the headlights by headlights front. Up, was it? Like that. That's better. Now we can see. Great. Sort of similar graphics to Flight Simulator. I'm just going to say. Look at that rain. It is bucketing down. I can't wonder wipers got remix. It looks a little fat, really. Turn on the wipers indicated switch. Here we go. How? 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 I'm doing it. I had to actually exit out. There we go. We have got wipers going. Look, that's just out of proportion. That's annoying me. A very important tool of the engineer is a horn. It's used to warn those ahead that a train is approaching. Press and hold the switch. Okay, well, now this is what we've been looking forward to. Okay, that just keep going, everybody. <laughs> Done and dusted. Secondary controls for... That particular engine, the SD Mac 70 or whatever, SD 70 Mac. There we go. Okay, secondary controls for class 170. What are they going to throw at us? It looks like they're going to throw rain at us again. Yeah, that must be my car. I just parked it beside here just to make life easier. It looks definitely like a training ground, this one. Got the Academy train. It's uh, showing me around. Okay, yep, we know what the story is. We're going to click right through that. Yep, we know about that too. All right, what's what are we going to see when it's dark? Okay, this seems quite repetitive, everybody. One notch clockwise. Bumpfer. Bumpfer. All right, we can see it here. Lovely. All right, it can be difficult to turn on the wipe. Okay, we are seeing a pattern developing here. No, oh, you got to turn this off. It's not. Yes, we're away. Okay, now we'll be able to see ahead. And the horn, okay, so this is our favourite part. This is the horn here. Push the lever to the left to sound the horn. Oh, that was a bit lame, that one. I want something a bit better than that. Okay. Okay, main menu. Let's get to it. I'm picking. We're going to be doing horn, wipers, sorry, wipers. Let's just quickly do this. We'll just check it out, because then at least we know what's going on. Okay, we're back, and it's... Uh let me guess. Lights, horn, and wipers. But at least we know where they are on each of these trains. Looks like I've upgraded my car since last time. Maybe they gave me an advance on my salary. Although they haven't given me the all clear to actually be a train driver yet. Headlights. Okay. When it's dark outside, active headlights pushing the switch all the way forward. Alright. That's actually backwards. Wrong switch, maybe. There we go. Helps if we've got the right switch on, everybody. That's nice and bright down there. Okay, where's the... Okay, we've got this one here. Which one is it? Clicking the indicator switch. That one. Wipers. Nice. We can see. The rain definitely looks more in proportion on this vehicle, which I'm happy about. Okay, horn. Here we go. How will this rain? That is lame. I'm putting it out there now. Okay. Back into the main menu. Let's get the steam. Oh, steam will be interesting, actually. Will it have wipers? What are the secondary controls for Steam? <coughs> Lord. 
look at it. Here it is here. That guy's still got his arm out the window. Does he not know it's raining? His sleeves just going to get drenched. Then again, I don't think he's... Uh, oh, that's, that's me on that side. I've got a nice hat. Look a bit older than I thought I was. Although a bit trimmer too. I'm pretty happy about that. Okay. Okay, I know there's more to just starting. So I should have read that. Additional controls. Okay, let me guess. Let me guess. When it's dark, it can be difficult for workers to see the train coming. Lamps, this time, called head codes, are placed in the front. Turn on the by pressing H. These are indicated by boxes that appear on the right of the screen. Find the one that says Class G Light Engine. Okay, let's try it. Boomfa. Class D. Class D. Class D Light Engine. Class D. There we go, we found it. All right, workers can now identify this train. Notice the lamps do not light up the track. Projecting headlights were not introduced until after the steam trains were retired from UK operation. Wow, they're a bit behind the times, weren't they? All right, next is, that's slightly different though. That was slightly different, that one. A whistle this time, whistle everybody. Press spacebar to click the lever shown in the picture sound the whistle, to sound the whistle. Hold it down, hold it down for effect. Look around while we're holding it down. That's enough whistle. Okay, we're back up the front to the main menu and we have completed all the secondary controls. So we know how to start, stop, and we know how to uh, put our window wipers on and we know how to uh, put our headlights on and we know how to blow our whistle or our horn. There we go. Oh, look at this difficulty. Look at this. Oh, it ramps up with diesel advanced brake systems. Holy moly, there's a lot of stuff going on here. Look how much there is. Okay, it looks like I've got a bit of work to do. Okay, what I think we'll do is how we're looking for video length. Okay, let's get the switching junctions sorted. Okay, in this lesson we'll learn about switching junctions. That sounds very good to me. Let's check it out. Okay, welcome to this rail yard in the academy. In this lesson, we'll learn about switching junctions. Okay. Modern busy railway lines are controlled remotely by a signaling, signaling center or dispatcher. Switches controlling the path of the train are automatic. In freight yards and depots, many small and frequent movements are required, making automatic control impractical. In yards, these switches are manual. Okay, good to know, good to know. The difference between two types of switches can be identified by the equipment. A manual switch has a lever to turn it one way or the other. An automatic switch has a small box containing a motor to drive it. Manual junctions can be operated by clicking the lever or pressing G on the keyboard. Okay, G for manual. They can also be changed on the action and 2D map. Automatic junctions cannot be operated. These are under the control of the signaling center of, dispatch, of the signaling center of dispatcher. Spit it out. All right. Up ahead, the path through the switch is set to the left. Using the free camera, camera key 8, fly over the switch and click on the lever to change its direction. Once set, drive the locomotive through the switch. OK. 8. Hold on, hold on, hold on, I think. This 8, maybe? No, I think I was on it. 8, and then... Oh, here we go. Use the keys. See, down, back. Back, back. Okay. At the moment, it's set to go left. We want it to. Did that work? Yeah, I think it did. I think we are going straight ahead now. We are. So, do we go eight again? To go back in? No. So, how do we get back in? Out? Do we go one? Maybe. There we go. Look at that. All right. Start and stop. Well, we know that we've got to uh, put the reverser. Back, is it? No, first forward. Forward. Um, we've got to pull the pit. No, 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 no. We've got to release the brake and then we'll pull the power down a little bit and see if that's working. Are we away? What have I forgot, everybody? Have I got this thing around the wrong way? Maybe. No, we're going reverse. Oh! That way. This way. 
Hold on. Ah! Oh no! Break, 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 break. See, it does say reverse down there. You have passed a signal of danger. Game over! Ah! What an absolute Barry Crocker. Okay, team, we are back. <laughs> oh. Hold on, let's go up here. I should check it out, make sure I've got it. <laughs> this is the only bit I can get right at the moment. Hold on. Okay, that comes away, so that should be good. So, no. Right, let's try this again. I'm gonna, gonna, I'm gonna stick. I don't really know what I'm. So, I think it's fine just here, is it? I, I'm sure I had to put that forward. Anyway, release the brake. This is 0% whatever this thing is, but let's see. If we give it a bit of power, we go forward. No, I can't leave. Now we need to go this. Just a little bit forward. Yes! Yes! Okay. It wasn't quite as... I think I haven't put this far, far enough forward and I don't think you can. It looks like you can't adjust it while you're moving by the looks of it. So this is going to be the slowest... Oh, let's put a bit of power down then. I was going to say this is going to be the slowest... Now we are slowing down. Why? No, we're staying at two. Why is it only going at two? I don't know the rules. It's too hard. We are moving forward though. 1.9. Let's pull it back up. Okay, once you go, remember you just put it up like that and then it coasts. The brakes are off. We are going ridiculously slow. Let's keep that power on then. I think the problem was I need to have this reverse out. Basically got it in neutral, I think. 1.5. Hold on, let's stop this. Let's stop this. No mucking around. Let's put the brake on. Right down. Okay, now that we're on zero, let's put the reverser up like that. Let's take the brake off. Put the power on. And I'm picking we are going to be away and right. There we go. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's hope we got this junction right. Ah, uh, no, just joking. We got it. We look for beauty. Do we have to stop? Oh, we have to stop the bloody thing now. Oh no, final destination reach. Thank God for that. <laughs> I'm surely that one was ultra hard difficulty. I keep freaking clicking out of that by mistake. Oh well. Look, ultra hard. See, blue means ultra hard. Let's ignore that. Right, let's do switching junctions for electrics. Let's see if we can get this right. <laughs> Oh, absolute shocker. Okay. Okay, here we go again. Okay, automatic, manual, bum bum bum, bum, same instructions as before everybody. Okay, we've got to go out eight. And whoa, 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 whoa! Something freaky's going on here. Oh, what did it say to do? I wasn't what? I wasn't what? At the moment, we are. I think we need to come over. Oh no, where are we going? Let's see. We're on this track here, and this one here is. Oh, what? What? What did he want me to do? I wasn't. I didn't read it. So this one here is definitely gonna looks like it's attached. So go left and then right. I think is what what they're saying they want us to do. Is it? Or straight? Oh well, hold on. This is what happens when you don't watch. Let's just go for it. Oh, can you bring up the? Uh, oh, let's just go for it. Eh? Let's just go for it. So put that on there. Let's turn the brakes off. This little thing here is way easier, by the way. I'm seeing these little controls, they seem much easier than that, the actual controls now. Let's just swing left, and then swing right. I don't know if that's what they want me to do, because I did not read properly. Oh no, left, sorry, yes, stay left, that's right, that's right. So we should get a pop-up here, say I've completed it successfully, or not. Okay, I should have probably read the instructions. Okay, when you're ready, you can, you can tell me. Okay, hold on, hold on. Reverse. Oh no! Stop! Stop! Ah! Ah! Okay. Okay, 
can we go outside the cab? Hold on. I might have derailed this thing. I have <laughs> derailed it. <laughs> oh. oh, what an absolute brilliant driver I am. Look at that. Outstanding. That's what happens. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. It still hasn't failed me. Restart. Oh, look, you can restart. Yes, bang. All right, we'll restart this scenario. Okay, okay, here we go. Let's read it this time. Okay, boom. Boom. Oh, look, an automoatic. That's a new term. I'm going to have to learn what that means. Okay, great. This is all good. Let's not click too far. Over the junction. Click the lever to change the direction. Up ahead, the path junction is set to left. Using the free camera, change its direction. Okay. All right, we needed to go straight. That's what we wanted to do, guys. Now, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. It's set to go left. That one there is set to go left. There, so it's actually this one right here. Hold on, that's not it. Where is it? Hold on, hold on, it's tricking me. So this one here is set to go left. Yeah. But how do I change it? That's an automatic. You see, this one up here is set to go left. Let's see. Is it? No, it's not. It's not. Oh, yes, it is. Hold on, there's no boxes. <laughs> the boxes have disappeared. They're gone. There are no boxes to change these things. I think I might have to reset things. All right, back in a second. Okay. Third time lucky, everybody. I said the one up ahead set to go left, and they want it to go straight ahead. So let's go this. So we go to eight. Okay, this time. See, this one here. So that is definitely set to go left. So let's change that to go straight. All right. Back into the cab. Uh, forward. Brakes off bit of power oh that seemed like you can hear things slipping i think can you i don't know i have no idea what i'm doing so all right here we go this time this is looking good i'm feeling confident about this give me my success slow this thing down okay final destination has been reached Whew. all right good stuff boom oh look it's giving me my stars now you little ripper so much worth it when you get those right here we go we'll do this one guys and then we'll finish things up start okay we are back in the steam train this time okay same deal i mean look we're really doing the same thing but let's read it properly this time okay it's set to the left okay we've got to reset it okay so exactly the same this is repetitive but you get a chance to try to drive the train which is obviously going to be handy. Hold on. There we go. We are loving life. Right. Should we do it the, the proper way? Okay. So what we've got to do, guys, is we've got to take the brake off. Boom, fuck. So you have got to put this handle up. The reverse it. Oh, yeah, there we go. And we've got to do something else that I've completely forgotten. Oh, this one. We've got to do it anti-clockwise, remember? Oh, yeah, that's a reverser right there. I'm getting it now. I'm getting it. So that should... Oh, we shouldn't really have it on a hundy this one so let's pull it down a bit there we go that's the throttle right there pull this into that just go outside the cab oh not that one this one here we go look at this how do you get rid of that hud I need to learn that one look at this thing we can zoom back a bit here can we no we can't the switching seemed to work though Scenario is complete. Good. Just in time. <laughs> and there we go, everybody. <laughs> we have got our star and we have switched junctions, which was a little bit more difficult. Well, I made it look a lot more difficult than it should have been. But anyway, guys, here we go. That's the second part of our tutorial. Learn along with me. Give me abuse. Give me support. But mainly abuse, too. And <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it. 
or it was cringeworthy. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Make sure you smash the like button once again. Subscribe if you're new, and until next time, take it easy.